the bar in your view. Hello and welcome back to Flyrod Crosby and me <laughs> and Benjamin. Benjamin's here to help. You can't see him, but you can hear him. About ready to start. Well, I have started staining. You saw the red hat. Now I'm going to do her blouse. First thing that I have to do before I start staining it. See, I'm using stain instead of paint because I wanted the grain to come through. And uh, stain is very loose. It kind of gets away from you sometimes. So I'm masking off all the areas I don't want affected by the stain. I'm gonna leave her hands and her face, her skin, you know, natural pine, and then finish it with a oil afterwards, which will get me the right color I think I'm looking for. With stain, I have to be very, very careful about drips. Keep her a little louder. Yeah. I don't think they can hear us in China. All right, we're going to do a quick walkabout, show you around the back. It's all taped up as much as I'm going to bother. Oh, I'm going to bag that. This thing here is going to get a bag. Check it, but go around the creel. Goodness, we're dropping bags. Jesse's here to make sure that we are mouse free. Benjamin's just here to sing for us. The moment of truth. I was going to go with a dark green, but I think we're going to keep it light with Hamilton Blue. It's good. This isn't as thin as I was afraid it would be. It's a nice, really thick consistency, so I can control it good. It's just semi transparent. So the green is coming through just like I wanted it to. It's going to be a little lovely color. Okay, so this is with most of the tape removed. So I got it all painted, and now I am distressing it. I'm using a piece of very fine, super fine steel wool, and just going over it. And what that's going to do is bring out the carving and give it kind of a an age settled look should look really sharp when she's all done. Well, I've got everything masked off here to do the creel. I'm going to do it in a Puritan pine. Of all this whole project, when it comes to the coloring of it, I've been looking forward to doing this probably the most. So, and going for it. And we'll see how the the pigment is going into the crevices so nice. It's like scrimshaw. Makes all those cups worthwhile. And it looks like a basket. I wanted to do this before I do her skirt, just in case. Excellent. it without the tape and stuff on it. Oh, that will look nice. Oh, baby. All right. Good. Moving on. Moving on. 